Hello everybody, welcome back to Arcade Time. This is our fourth episode of Ocarina of Time. We're about to meet Zelda here. You know, I think that, uh... Are you serious? Dude, maybe that's not. the second I time. Keep, yeah. yeah I, I'm just trying to rush it. Just trying to rush it. We're not... By the time we were like halfway done with the series, we're gonna be like, welcome back to episode. I really don't care. <laughs> like, it's not like we're actually gonna remember. Uh, yeah, I already have to look down at my notebook to find out what yeah, episode we're really. <laughs> But, uh, oh. oh, yeah. Oh, if you're writing it down, then. I, yeah, and I Probably. realize that I keep, like, clicking this okay, pen. Okay, that with makes my him hand. mad. See, he's supposed to be right there, and he wasn't last time. He always is. So I was just running through, like, okay, I'm gonna do this. And then he changed the positions. Changing of the guard. Yes. Good job. Good job. Okay. Okay, we got it. I got a little bit nervous there. That he saw in me. <laughs> Tempted to get these, but uh. Oh my are you gosh. serious? I'm gonna do this at every single <laughs> stage. Oh my gosh! What am I? Do? I've never. I like. I never get caught. Maybe you're focused on the game too much. Let's think of something. Even the to last talk time. About. Even the last time we played this, like. <laughs> I had no issues getting passes. Okay. Well. Well. Uh. What should we talk about? I don't know. Okay. So. <laughs> So I was at an amusement park the other day. Okay. And uh Oh yeah, you you almost invited me to it and then you decided I shouldn't go. Well <laughs> I I'm sorry. I uh I was going with one of my friends who I haven't seen in a while. And uh we were kinda just you know, we haven't we haven't really seen each other in a while. I was like, Well, it's probably probably nice to have just quality time a, a day that we can kinda uh rekindle our love. Not really, but guys, I'm kidding please <laughs> no but uh so we were riding the roller coasters okay and we were getting sick because we rode them for a while mm -hmm. and we didn't eat because the food is really expensive okay so it's starting to feel sick and plus and by the way guys i know this is kind of like Whoa. i don't know if this is true but I'm pretty sure that they purposely make the seats on roller coasters push up against your nuts. <laughs> and I swear, because... Oh, yes, I have that problem every time I go to an no, amusement but park. When a guy is gets, like, discomfort or a little bit of, like, pain or whatever mm -hmm. in their nuts, it upsets their stomach. Oh, okay. And the seats do that, like, incredibly purposefully seeming amount <laughs> okay and then their food's really expensive so I, I actually I have a suspicion that they make roller coaster seats push against men's nuts so that they get hungry and are forced to buy their food okay that's I don't know if that very... is that just me let me know if you guys if you guys <laughs> agree with that I, I if you guys go to you know amusement parks and you notice that you know, help me out here. I actually think that might be true. <laughs> that is probably one of the weirdest observations anybody has ever made before. Well, yeah, but because we en we ended up leaving earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I noticed. Because a burger was six dollars, and it was not a big burger. It was a like one dollar one cheeseburger. Dollar, yeah. yeah, and I was like, we went out to. Burger King after we left mm -hmm. and I got 20 nuggets a bacon <laughs> cheeseburger a double cheeseburger a large drink and Holy a fry cow. for the same price as like one burger and how do you put all that away and just yeah like I was like after I ate all that we were like oh <laughs> I have to it was, drive now no I just wanted to prove how much food I could get <laughs> and I ended up like almost getting sick but uh I mean one burger isn't enough and for six dollars that's like half of a ticket to the park <laughs> not really but like, dang hmm. but uh, that's how they get a lot of their money because well uh, uh yeah a lot of people still go yeah, to music really parks is. but i don't think there there really wasn't that many people well, I think it's because we went earlier though i think it's because school started up in, in the summer it's always going to be packed it was sunday when it like oh it was sunday yeah sunday at that could explain it too i'm sure on saturdays or f like friday i don't know if they're open on friday but like friday evenings they probably would have been a lot busier 
the line for the most like popular roller coaster took us like five minutes to get on. Oh wow, that's so awesome. it was. We rode like all the rides twice in like three hours, and then we left. And people were like, uh, we were texting people or whatever, and they were like, "Wow, you guys are leaving already." It's like, what are we supposed to ride the same roller coasters like three more times? I, mean, <laughs> I don't know. Like small amusement park, huh? Well, it wasn't too small. It's like six decent rides. Six? Okay. I mean, mm. back where we used to live. I know. <laughs> there was an amusement park. I was like that with... the whole time. I was like, it, whoa. It's like, this is like a fourth as big as the one that I used to live by. I really want to go was to Disneyland. Was it even a, a, to Disneyland? We lived like six hours away. And we never Four went. hours, maybe. We never went anywhere. Like, it, it was really just like <laughs> a day trip. And not, not like one day, but like. You, you leave the morning and then like leave, leave the next day or whatever mm-hmm. at night. It, it was like four four hours maybe. And we never went once. It's okay. You we just want to see Harry Potter world. We never went once. <laughs> and we lived right there. And now we live like... Miles away. What? 17, 18 hours away? More, Crazy. Probably more than that. More like 22, 20, 21, 22, yeah. So... I don't know. I don't know. I uh, I hope that I have... Well, I'm sure I will someday. I hope that I have the opportunity to go when I want to. Because mm-hmm. I know that once I get older, I'm probably going to not really want to go. Well, maybe. I don't know. Some people... I hope I hope I don't grow up to be like one of those boring old people. They're like, <laughs> get off my lawn. <laughs> not really. That was a terrible old person. I got this. I'm like, get off my lawn. Oh. I- what? I don't I'm done. Know. I'm sorry. That was that wasn't that was more of a like <laughs> pedophile. <laughs> I was supposed oh to I was supposed to be like a oh like my back hurts, but it was like a <laughs> oh touch me again please. Oh my gosh. So <sighs> Herbert Herbert the pervert. You mm. know that? Have no, you... no. What is this? What? I've heard you say it a million Herbert times. Herbert the pervert. But I don't it's from know. Family Guy, dude. He's, oh. he's the old guy. Oh who, like, yeah. Okay. Really okay. It's like yeah. I can't I can't do any voices. Um like well I can do no I can't really do any like famous voices, but I can yes, I can you, do some you, voices. You can do Kronk's voice. No, I can't. <laughs> I cannot. I was making a joke once about how everybody's like, hey, Peter. <laughs> and every everybody says it. And everyone can do it, literally. It's not like and I can't I can't say anything else. And it's well maybe I could. I haven't really tried, but Everyone, everybody's just like, "Hey, I, I can do uh, Joe's voice from Family Guy." And everyone's like, "Huh? What? Ah, so cool!" It's like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." Watch this, Peter. And they're like, "Oh, oh, that's so impressive!" It's like, "Oh, thank, thank you. I've been practicing." And like, nobody knows how to say anything else. They're just Peter, Peter, Peter. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, that was the joke. And so, no, I cannot. I can say one word as well as ninety-five percent of the uh, population of the planet. I can't, so. Well, that's, that's, well, I mean, okay, 95% of men, I guess, because, well, women's voices are higher. Yeah, that's true. And, uh, what is the guy's name? What guy? The actor, the voice actor, Kronk, or, oh. or in Joe, in that situation. I like how Kronk is always the, the name we go to. <laughs> yes. It's like. I don't know, growing up, Emperor's New Groove was it's like one of the shows that we watched a lot as a kid. Mm-hmm. Well, as kids. We watched too much TV, didn't we? Dragon Tales. Dragon Tales. We worked a lot too, though, so. We weren't. We weren't. We, we didn't weren't, watch. Yeah. Yeah, we did. We watched. Okay. I think it was. we were When we were younger, we watched a lot of TV and movies. And mm-hmm. then when we hit about, what, you were nine, maybe? nine probably we started working outside and yeah we uh we kind of grew up a bit and now we uh don't do anything again <laughs> not really <laughs> we're in college yeah like uh, life is life sucks <laughs> that's so that's so bad i'm it's not gonna so get on the pressing topic but like <sighs> hate to break it to you kids but <laughs> life well, sucks when you get older it's just there's so much, you know, like responsibility and things you have to do all the time. Mm-hmm. You don't, you don't get to do the things that you enjoy doing anymore, and it's, it's 
Or if you do, you have to make time for them, and then it makes it almost more stressful. Yeah, I know. Even (laughs) to do this, Mm -hmm. like, I'm putting aside, like, a bunch of homework that I'm going to have to cram and stuff later for. Yep. But uh, it's worth it. I really do enjoy this. But, yeah, you do have to pay for it, I guess. Mm -hmm. Let's just not think about it. Don't think about it. Well, really, (laughs) it's it's, it's depressing. But I think, uh, actually, after you graduate... It'll be a, it'll be a lot better, I think. Depends on the job. You yeah, get. <laughs> unless you're just like, uh, yeah, you are not a very important asset to this company. <laughs> like, oh, dude, oh, that would man. suck. What? Like, getting fired from a job that you've been working at for a really long time that like you depend on, mm-hmm. like for a living. You have like yeah. kids and stuff. <sighs> do you want to have kids? No. I don't think I do either. Like. I like I like kids. Mhm. <laughs> but I don't like kids in quantities. Oh. If that okay. makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense cuz I was just going to say no, you don't like kids. Yeah, we but... went we, we went to a football <laughs> game thing and there's a bunch of kids like running around screaming and throwing footballs and I was <laughs> Oh man. I was just like, "Oh, I hate kids." I could just see like the smoke coming out of the top of his head and he's like, why are there so many of them? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, I like kids. Like, I like the the thought of, you know, having a son or daughter and then, you know, mm-hmm. raising them and, ha- like, I don't know. It's it's kind of weird. Like, I don't, I don't like kids a super amount, but I, can't, I like the thought of, like, like, getting to be an important part of somebody's life yeah. their whole life through. Kind of like, I don't know. It's, it just seems like... Oh, crap. What? I, uh... I'm supposed to get a shield. You don't need to. That's true. Oh, yeah, I could just I could just side hop through. Let my shield burn in the fire temple. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'll actually do that. <laughs> I was... Just saying. No, I'm actually going to do that. I'm not going to run all the way back for a shield. I didn't even mean to talk to this guy. I was side hopping and he won't shut up. <laughs> no, I can't even skip it. I didn't. I, I was literally just side hopping. It's, he's like those teachers in the hall. Oh, that yeah. You're like, hi. And then they just start this huge conversation with you about what they did last night. And you're like, I really like, don't care. <laughs> you're like, you know what I did last night? Um, I'm not going to tell you because I'm not a rude piece of crap. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> nah. Oh, don't forget the sun song. I, uh, I won't, but I'm going to do the temple first, I think. Then I'll get on the way out. You know, this is yeah. Zelda's handwriting. I wonder how crappy her handwriting looks. Yeah, she's like <laughs> nine kid, years old. Yeah. It's like, I never had a formal education. I've been stuck in the castle the whole time. Drawing, like. <laughs> this she draws him the and then draws a mountain. She's like, oh, this is definitely Zelda's handwriting. <laughs> Sending a nine-year-old boy to an active volcano zone. <laughs> it's like, ah, uh, there's definitely something up there. Uh, it's just like, they don't even bat an eyelash. They're just like, ah, eh, he'll be okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. I do have to go back to get a shield, though. Okay. Because I have to get sorry, son. So I might as well just grab a shield. Get the mask while you're there. I don't know if I can. I don't remember when it becomes available. It becomes available after you talk to him. Because it wasn't available. No, I talked to him last time. No, I didn't. I I was smart, and I bought the shield before I talked to him. Yeah. Which actually isn't that smart, I guess. Depends on how you're playing, I suppose. Yeah. So I can just turn around now and go get Sorry song, right? You can. I I think so. I don't think I have to talk to anybody. No, I I don't. I don't think so. I don't think so. So we're going to probably gonna get, go all the way there and then realize she's not there <sighs> dude that would suck <laughs> i usually d- no no she's she's there i'm i'm pretty sure i've done this before anyway guys uh, i think this is about uh it's about it for this episode all right so uh thank you all for joining us this, this this fine evening i think i've said that like in every episode <laughs> Yeah, I, I keep thinking, like, it's probably not even evening when they're watching this. They're well, probably... yeah, well, that is true. <laughs> so, evening for us. It is. And, uh, it is a fine evening. It's a nice, little bit chilly. Kind of, kind of a little bit damp. I actually, I like days like that. Mm-hmm. Kind of rainy and stuff. Yeah. But, uh, 
yeah, well, thank you guys all so much for joining us today. We'll catch you guys next time.